have to be down on yourself if you're not it now. You don't have to be down if you're not successful now. You don't have to be down if your business is working through the same environment, financial environment that every other business is working through now. But you can persist and press on to the high calling because some businesses are not suffering right now. Some relationships are not suffering right now. Some people doing good and very good. You have to press on, you have to persist. What's the next thing on your bulletin say? How do you apply it? What does that next point say? Don't give up easily. Don't give up easily. See, in, in, in discovering yourself, in discovering yourself, <laughs> you will always present yourself with opportunities to realize your true self. In, in some places, they will say that the devil puts this before you. Here, we would say that your adverse consciousness or even your propensity to grow puts stuff in front of you. When I, when I work out, when I, when I work out with, with weights, there's no way for me to get the press and the build and the growth that I need without experiencing some resistance. It doesn't matter if I lift weights. It doesn't matter if I run. It doesn't matter if I carry my, my golf bag. Anything that I do requires that I work through some resistance. It's not going to be easy. Who told you that? Get that out of your head. It can be. It can be easy. It can be. It can be. It can be. It can be, it can be, but it wasn't easy for Jesus. It wasn't easy for Muhammad. It wasn't easy for Moses. It wasn't easy for Abraham. It wasn't easy for Mary. It wasn't easy for Sarah. It wasn't easy for Naomi. You know, it wasn't easy for me. It wasn't easy for Johnny. It wasn't easy for Charles Fillmore. It can be easy, but the evidence suggests that in each and every experience you work through, you evolve to and through the next step. You evolve to and through the next step. So you have to be willing, if it does not come easy, then you can't give up easy. Don't quit on yourself before the race even begins. 